So the Malaysians on you sink and you Yi on the side of the court getting this first one men's doubles on the way against the Dane. Japan Open, men's doubles title. And one of them happens to be Per Steen. That was uh, <coughs> last pass in uh, Jonas Rasmussen. 16, well done to the players, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Considerably a lot more well done to the players. Yeah, which is actually, in terms of Danish men's doubles, super young. They've been practicing a win a little bit unexpectedly, but, but perhaps not a win over pairs that are top five in yeah. the world. Confidence tends to raise the sort of expectations as well. So it's a constant battle. But it's interesting this year. Yeah. They reach the final. So you build up that confidence. This is the first through the um, the feeder circuits, the European circuits, the Asian circuits, wherever it is. And and earn It was Teal, I believe, who was the inward. Yeah, it's a good one. Yeah. What? Yeah. So good. Oh, really? Possibly the longest run of the match so far. Out on that serve, does he? No. No. no, that's quite consistent. Service over. And Sukumulio, then we knew he was capable of doing that. Yeah, and we would um, say, Yeah, yeah, we know that uh, he misses once yeah. in a while. So I'm guessing it was fairly difficult to hear any coach. He was <laughs> the, the taller one of them, yeah, yeah, that's the one. <laughs> one of those things that. Every athlete should remember the name of another athlete that beats them. Yeah. So <laughs> <laughs> it's over. A drift. Uh, a good placement of this. Oh, that down to the top of the tape. Yeah, just touched it. So it's over. A little nervous playing in this magnificent arena on the big stage on the television court. Oh, behind the back. So it's over. So, beginning of April, so just over four months. Oh, yeah, you're right on that left shoulder there of Jump Tui Yi. Sometimes he's um, strapping that has. Savi Sober! Tui Yi. Savi Sober! Opening game. Tui Yi from Malaysia against the Danes. This will Oh, my goodness, behind the back from Yi. Yeah. And uh, it's going to be tough. So, um, harder work in the. Um the first and the third to 10 and 14 lost the uh, second to 19 so um yeah. they've been a pair we talked about the fact that they've been number six on the world rankings they won a bronze medal in 2021 world championship past but but they have 
a lot of quality as a pair. They've got a lot of technical skills. They've got yes. a lot of game reading skills. Setups got started, got back on playing badminton earlier after the pandemic. I'm sure. I'm a little unsure whether the independent pairs were invited into practice as okay. well during COVID. That might be a, just a practice, so to speak. You want to want to get back in shape uh, in double quick time. Now that's a, a variation. Yeah. And again. So that's the way that. Uh, still, I can't put it away. <laughs> Finally. Played extremely well. <laughs> Indeed, it was out. Well done. Got to take that chance, and I think that is the key here. Of Ong Yusin, but they also got to find some way to uh, to convert on the attack. I don't. See. It's almost as if they've uh, sink in. I agree. And also, it looks like they have no idea where the next shot is coming. Turn. Perfect example there. The Up uh, on into you. 21 14 in the first game. They're not going to get uh, spooked by it. Well, so much for my comment and so theory in the opening game, Steve. The Malaysians didn't look match sharp. It <laughs> <laughs> is right now because they haven't had to use it here. No, that's, a, that's a fair comment. It's on nice. Ong and Teal. Yeah. Point opportunities. Good return. It's gone wrong. Game. 